Due to a crime alert and a break in the case of a missing South Florida mother and daughter. The FBI arresting the child's father, who has long been a person of interest in connection with this investigation. Local 10's Terrell Fernay, live now in Miami, with what he's learned tonight. Terrell. And those FBI agents making that arrest just today, more than eight and a half years after this crime first happened. We know that that suspect is being held here at the Federal Detention Center in Miami. Eight years after the strange disappearance of Liliana Moreno and her young daughter, Daniela, detectives have delivered news of a big break in the case to anxious loved ones. It has been eight years that we haven't heard nothing from them. So it was really, really shocking and give uh, like uh, something unbel unbelievable. That's Liliana's brother and the uncle of that then eight-year-old girl reacting to the arrest of Gustavo Castaño. That ex was under a cloud of suspicion from the very beginning. He is the girl's biological father, and he kept that as a secret from his own wife and family at the time. Castaño told detectives he dropped the pair off near a Home Depot in Hialeah Gardens. Sources have now confirmed to Local 10 that a federal grand jury has indicted Castaño on two counts of kidnapping resulting in death. At least it's the beginning to know what happened with them and know where the location of them. That is the main goal for, for, for us to know where they are. Dozens of people have participated in search efforts over the years, and an annual vigil has been held outside of Castaño's home to pressure him to talk. Loved ones, though, refuse to give up hope. She's my niece, and like uncle, I, I'm expecting to see her back. No, I don't expect that her story just ended that same day. And his niece, who again was just eight years old at the time of her disappearance, would have celebrated her 17th birthday earlier this month. Mm -hmm. He is uh, expecting and still hoping, as you heard, not giving up hope at least, for the safe return of both his niece and also his sister. We know that Castano is expected to face a judge here in Miami sometime within the next day or two. We are live in Miami. I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News. Long